as your stomach splits it. Hello, hi, it's Spam and it's me, LT. Um, I have recently got my room redone. Things are a lot different. We're living in like dream spaces, dream vibes, like all that kind of goody good stuff. With the start of the new season, you know, we're trying to improve our life and improve our life happen. I'm also gonna be getting Greg well and telling you guys what we're doing today. I'm going to go hygiene shopping for the summer. So basically we have a couple of things to do today. Go to Trader Joe's to get some food for the week. I need to go to Target to get some skincare, body care stuff. And I have a nail appointment, that's it. Those are all the things. And then I'm gonna do my brother's hair and then we're going to get ramen later. Because his birthday is on Saturday. My little brother is turning 21 and that's insane. I want you to come along with me while I go do my hygiene shopping and my skincare shopping. So we're gonna get ready. Okay. lovely nail tech Demetria. this is what my nails look like like Frenchies with like little Roy G Biv hearts for pride month because it is pride month happy pride month I'm not gonna get too much into that because that's not why I'm here but or I hope that anyone and everyone knows that if you are ever feeling lost any senses of that kind of nature or anything like that I hope you know that you always have a friend here in me to confide in and to talk and that you don't ever have to go through anything like this by yourself with all that going on let's back into the the main topics of this video i have made it to the super target i'm at a super target that i've never been to before it's the closest to the destination i need to go to next to get groceries filming in public already gives me kind of anxiety so i don't know how much of this i'm going to get to film but i've been trying to use my times that i'm up at night to like make list and stuff for myself for the next day set myself up for success these are basically all the things that we have to get today i'm gonna kind of talk to you guys just about why i decided to go hygiene shopping why i'm getting some of the things that i'm getting i found lately that i've been really into skincare shorts and reels and stuff like that because i'm really trying to find products that help me target certain things and i don't know if that's realistic or not but i'm also just trying to understand like why i'm using products and not just buying products because girly pop 6b75 has it in her reel like do i actually need that you guys kind of like the products i'm getting and i'm going to tell you guys about why i'm getting them One of the things on my list are bath towels. Guys, I'm so anxious filming here and I don't know why. I need some towels because I don't feel like I have enough. I think this set of towels is like eight for five dollars. Guys, people keep looking for me stressing me out, but I'm gonna get this set of towels. Um, I basically need some new towels because I kind of have been just like thinking and I think that it's kind of gross to like keep the same towels for like a while and in keeping the same towels for a while you know like it just doesn't make sense I feel like it's kind of gross so I think I need to like swap out my towel so I just have like more freshness I've been like 
really in my head lately about like being very clean and I don't know why. That's pretty much it. Now we're gonna go over to the skincare section. We've made our arrival. Um, we are starting in the the um, mouth section. Oral care section, that's what it's called. On the list for the oral care section, we have mouthwash, toothbrushes, that's it. So I have these little Steropod containers. They're actually great. I'm really just looking for a nice toothbrush to be honest. This one. Guys, also, can I just talk about how the only place that I feel the most uncomfortable filming is literally It's walled by three times, it's stressing me out. Hygiene products are so expensive, and I feel like no one talks about it, and it's actually baffling. Just trying to find body wash. So guys, one of the things that I need is exfoliators, body exfoliators, and I've heard really good thing about these Dove exfoliating polishes. Try and get more fruity scents. Yeah. Pomegranate seed and shea butter. I get exfoliators because they help me, they really just help feel, they help me feel like I really got all that nasty junk off of my body, to be honest. Okay, so here's the sitch. We made it out of Target. Um, I found a lot of like the cleaning stuff that I need for my body, but I didn't find a lot of like the serums and facial oils and stuff. So, we're gonna go somewhere else for that. Probably not today though, because I have other commitments. But yes, okay, let us move. We're gonna speed run. So it's a couple days later, I finished the hygiene shopping and I'm just here to show you guys like what I got. I'm gonna start with Target since that's the stuff that you guys saw me getting. I go to Target, I got some stuff from Trader Joe's and then I also got some stuff from Walmart. So I got these, Cetaphil face wipes. Um, I got these because when I get up in the morning, I literally just need something to kind of like wipe my face off because I wash my face before I go to sleep as well as I wash my face when I get home from the gym and everything like that. And these are just really nice cleaning, especially like with summer fashion work. I bought into the hype. <sighs> the La Rouge Pousset. Um, This is the facial moisturizer. I picked up the Dove body polish. I got the pink lemonade and mandarin orange ones from St. Ives. St. Ives low-key has some of my favorite body wash. Like when you put it on, it glides on so smoothly. I got another dry brush. Uh, I suffer really bad from like, I guess it's called strawberry legs. I just learned that term. But basically like my legs are very like, I don't know how to explain it. Like they're just like real prickly. I'll put a picture of what strawberry legs look like. I picked up some scrunchies. This is not really hygiene related brushes. These Oral-B charcoal infused toothbrushes. I think I was going to what? Huh? I was watching a hygiene video. I don't know by which YouTuber, but they recommended the Flamingo Razor, and so then I got the Flamingo Razor, and like low key would never go back. Is that crazy? I swore up and down I was a Venus girly. You know what I mean? And maybe that's because of the hype. But then I picked up the Flamingo Razor, and let me tell you guys why I like it. First of all, as y'all can see, the blades, like it looks sharp on the box, right? It's sharp in real life. If you get the whole set, I think it's like $20 or less for like the entire 
like said it comes with a shower holder that you put in the shower and a little silicone thing you stick on and then it also comes with two cartridges just on the first go right and so then i got this refill and this is eight blades and it was only 16 dollars this class i've never tried this one i don't think so lastly from target i picked up some towels i don't know if the color is going to come up but they're this like cream color i want to do like a white and I want green to be like the accent color. I really like the color green. I have decided like dark greens more so, but um, I really like the color green real bad. So I decided to pick up some like green towels. Run through Trader Joe's, I literally only got two things. This sunscreen, please focus. This sunscreen from Trader Joe's eats, definitely eats. And I picked up a Mr. Bronner's uh, soap bar. So what I was basically gonna say with the St. Ives is I like to double cleanse. So I use like a nice cleaning bar soap and then I go back in and use a body wash. So I know some people have like, if the body wash isn't overly cleaning you, it becomes an issue. And I do think that with like cheaper body washes, like not saying that St. Ives is cheap, just saying like, price point comparison wise it is a cheaper body wash and sometimes I do fear that with those I'm not actually going to be clean it's just going to kind of like keep the smell without actually cleaning my body so I like to use a bar soap too and uh this one the all-in-one hemp peppermint pure castle bar soap is my favorite um I got some of these little crest breath sprays if you know you know she is the star I swear by this chapstick. Me everywhere. She will always be famous in this house. Blistex, please call me. Um, I got a deep pore scrub by Burt's and Bees. I really like Burt's and Bees products. Uh, I got this because I usually do my like facial exfoliating and stuff like that at night when I take my like showers and stuff. So I want to try this one, Hyaluronic Acid Facial Serum. I have a Hyaluronic Acid now, but I'm just trying something else out. It is by True Skin. Hyaluronic Acid, basically it helps your moisturizers and stuff really actually absorb into your face, which is why I like Hyaluronic Acid. Um, I do feel like that when I started using a Hyaluronic Acid serum and oil and everything like that, I really saw a huge difference in just like how my skin feels and like how my face feels like right now my face feels so soft and I literally think it's just because it's actually moisturized and like the products are getting into my skin maybe I'm believing the hype I don't know and then I got this eye cream I've been using this one eye cream for like forever and I'm almost out please focus the last item is I just got this mini toothpaste. I'm going to be traveling soon. So that is all for this hygiene shopping with me vlog. I will be sure to let you guys know how I like the products. Stay tuned for other videos to see me using the products. And maybe I'll give some little reviews on what I think about them. But until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.